people come to Chamonix to do crazy things, says our taxi driver, as a car whizzes past us pulling a man on a skateboard. Yes, crazy, but Chamonix also has a hardcore reputation, attracting adrenaline junkies, powder hounds and skiers who think long lunches waste prized pies time. Little more than an hour from Geneva Airport, Chamonix is perfectly positioned for a high-octane weekend, and there's no shortage of snow this season. But let's be clear, it is not geared towards beginners. Borders and skiers alike come for the formidably steep descents and iconic off piste routes, such as the Volley Blanche, a 12 mile decline from the top of the 3,842 meters high Aiguille du Midi, accessed only via a steep ridge with sheer drops. Where you stay is important, because Chamonix isn't a ski-in, ski-out destination. We are billeted in the Rocky Pop, a cool concept hotel that opened last year on the outskirts of family-friendly Les Houches, a short bus ride from Chamonix Center. Rooms are basic, but affordable. Dorm rooms for 12 equate to just £6 per person per night. Ski season workers swarm here in the evenings for wood fired pizzas or signature cocktails. It's a fun filled, sociable outpost. It is also a good place to discover the best skiing for the next day from locals at the bar. We head to the 3,300 meter summit of Les Grands Montets after insiders tell us it offers the most challenging off piste skiing and plenty of steep, deep runs. From the top, you have